y'all hey it's lisa and welcome to my channel today i am going to be doing a rewind spread in my b6 size so much crafting inserts i am going to be planning for the week of july 30th through august 5th and this week i will be using this kit right here from simply ginger co this is a b6 formatted kit so yeah, I'm excited to be using these to see how everything is going to turn out. So yeah, guys, if you are interested in seeing me playing with this kit, then stay tuned and let's get to planning. So I'm just going to jump right into it today, guys, because I figure like this could be a really quick video since I don't have as many pages to go through as I would in a regular kit. So yeah, I think this should be rather quick. Now I say that guys, and this will take me about 30 to 40 minutes, <laughs> but hopefully it doesn't. But yeah, uh, this video is going to go up on a Friday because I feel like I am so behind on my B6 spreads even though there's no time limit or anything like that but I want to be able to uh, be at least one week behind and I feel like I'm two weeks behind so with this video going up on Friday I should be uh, on the schedule that I want to be on for these uh, rewind spreads and guys, I really love the way last week turned out with me putting my scallop boxes down here and the full boxes up here. So I think I am going to continue that for this week. And I am going to place my scallop boxes down. And then I did choose some date covers, guys. These are from Rose Color Days. These are her double dates. And I got these by mistake. <laughs> and uh, I hardly ever get to use these. And I say that and I have two rows missing. But I, I've had these for a while. So, But anyway, I am rambling. And that that is what makes the video long, right? <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, for headers, oh, you know what? I did not pick out any headers. So, let me find some headers that I think would work for this kit. And I will be right back. Okay, guys. I am back and I have found some headers. I think these will work well with this pink shade that's in the kit. This is a very unusual pink shade, so... But I think these are going to work well. And then I am going to take these black ones here from Temp Love's Crafts. Because I think these will work with this spread as well. So yeah guys, so much for being prepared. I call myself being all prepared this week. And I was going to get it going and get it done quick. So it wouldn't be such a long video. And already I have screwed up. <laughs> But that's okay, y'all. I'm just going to keep it moving. So anyhow, guys, I am going to go ahead and place down my uh, scalloped boxes. I have chosen these right here from Panda Bird Designs. And I think I'm going to choose this color right here. I like these for the spread. So, of course, I'm going to place one on Monday. Wednesday and Friday. All right, and now, guys, I am going to place down my date covers and the first row of headers, and I'm going to speed you all through that. So I will be back in two minutes and two seconds.
right guys, we can now go ahead and place down our foil boxes. Let me zoom you guys in a little bit. I always forget that. All right, now I can go ahead and place down these boxes. So I think we are going to go with the quotes in the middle. And I don't think I'm gonna put that black box well not black it's not black it's beige and striped i don't know if i should put that one down because it really doesn't match the the rest of the boxes right or maybe oh you know what maybe i should put that one down in the middle and put the rest of the boxes around that one and we'll see how that's going to work because I've already brought in black glitter headers and things, so and the beige with the scalloped boxes. So let's uh, bring this box in just to add that color. There we go. And then I'm not going to go with the quote box now since I've put this one here. I'll go with the rest of these boxes. So let's put the little shoes next shoes and flowers and then let's go with i want to go with the pineapple because i think it's cute so i'm going to take the pineapple and then let's go with the What do you call this elephant plant or palm trees? So let's put the palm trees down. And the last box is, the, oh no, that was kind of cray cray. Lisa, you put two of the white boxes next to each other. <laughs> so let's move the pine, uh, palm trees and then we'll have one box. And, okay, let's do that. I wasn't paying attention to what I was doing, y'all. So let's just move this box out of the way. Now, I dare not use undo in these inserts, I've told you guys, because this paper will tear so fast. It will tear so fast. And I don't like to hear that paper <laughs> turn in my inserts, so. I am going to use my undo whenever I get a chance to use it. There we go. And now I can go ahead and place down these glitter headers, y'all. Alright y'all, I have placed the glitter headers down and now we can get started with Monday. On Monday, I am starting with this half box and this little emoji from Michaels to note down that I went into Michaels. <laughs> I am looking for a new backdrop and I wanted to go in there and check and see what they had. So... Uh, I did that on my lunch break. And the next thing I want to mark y'all is that I had to edit a video. So for that, I'm going to take one of her little quarter boxes that she has here. And I think I'll take a pattern one since I started with a solid uh, half box there. And then I am going to take an edit sticker from um, Magic Prince Co. So she has this really cute uh, computer screen right here. So I am going to take that 
and I'm gonna take this uh, edit sticker from Magic Prints Co to mark down uh, editing a video on this Monday and I don't know should I put it the edit sticker inside the computer or no I'll just put it right here we'll just put it right there it's fine and the last thing I want to mark on Monday is that I fixed myself a chicken Caesar salad that's one of my favorite dishes that I eat y'all so I am taking this salad sticker right here from happy day of stickers to mark down that I had a Caesar salad for dinner. And we can move on to Tuesday. On Tuesday, I am going to take another half box and I'll take a printed one this time as well. And I think I'll take this, no, not that one. Let's take this blue one right here. And I'm just going to place that here because I want to mark down that I did laundry this day. So I'm going to take this laundry script sticker from uh, the Sticky Committee. And then she has a really cute little basket of clothes. I thought this was a clothes basket, y'all, but that's food basket. <laughs> but here's a little laundry basket. Let's take that in just place that on the side right should we put it on the top or the side yeah let's just place it right there for doing laundry slide it right on in and then i want to mark that i did not get any happy mail y'all i was so upset i was looking for some mail to come in and nope didn't get it <laughs> so i am going to take a quarter box and I'm just going to place that at the top right here. And I'm going to take one of my bougies to note down that I didn't get any happy mail. See the tears? <laughs> That's how I felt. I was so sad. And next, guys, we are just going to thug up these plans. I didn't have a very busy day, so we might as well thug up the plans right here. Taking a two-pot this time, says, planners know how to party. Planners know how to party. <laughs> I don't know if I know how to party, but I know how to plan, that's for sure. <laughs> and moving on to Wednesday, it was hot. Day. So let's take a hump day sticker from uh, Bookish Planning to mark down that it was hump day. So I'm just going to take this script and just place it right here because she does have a little bowl sticker in here, guys, that I want to use for hump day. So we might as well use it. There we go. There we go. And then I also want to mark down that my Happy Mail came in this day, y'all. I was so happy. So for that, I'm going to take one of these quarter boxes to mark down that I did get my Happy Mail this day. So let's check this pink box right here. And then I'm going to take this uh, Happy Mail sticker that she has here. Let's place it over here. And then I also want to put in this Happy Mail script from uh, Magic Prints Co. to mark down Happy Mail. Let's just place it right there. Because I can tell you now my script is going to be too long. So yeah, that's nice. And the last thing I want to mark on Wednesday, y'all, is that I was watching uh, Suits. Do you guys watch Suits and Sinners? 
I think it, I think that was the first day of the new premiere of Sinners. So, yeah, I want to mark that down. So, for marking that, I'm taking this television right here from Tasseled Planners. And I'll just place it right on top of our scallop box. And I will mark in the television show on... Uh, in the box. Moving on to Thursday, y'all. What do we do on Thursday? Oh, I did my nails. So I want to mark down that I redid my nails. So let's take this quarter box right here to mark down nails. And I will be taking one of the nail polish stickers that came in the kit to mark nails, doing nails. Let's just place it straight up so it, it'll kind of look like it's fitting in the box there. And then I want to mark that I took photos for uh, Insta. So it is time for a solid box. So let's just take this um, half box right here. And then I'm going to take a camera from Happy Day of Stickers as well to mark down that I took photos for Insta. For the gram, y'all. For the gram. And I'm going to place it right here in the center. Moving on to Friday, guys. I'm going to take this sticker from a Little Red Prince that says, Friday is my second fav favorite F word. Because <laughs> we want to mark Friday. And on Friday, I went to Michael's again, y'all. Because they had a, they had sent a 25% off coupon for uh, just being a, I don't know, I don't know where that coupon came from, but it they sent it to me and I wanted to use it, but I didn't get a chance to use it because I was looking for this specific uh, item that I had been going in the store. I had been looking at it every time I go in the store and y'all, as soon as I get the extra 25% off, it was gone. So I was like, oh. So anyhow, I'm taking another emoji sticker. And I am going to place that on a corner box. Let's take, it's time for a solid quarter box. So I'm just going to take this blue one here. And the emoji is from the Coffee Monsters Co, y'all. And. Let's place it down here. And the last thing I want to mark on Friday is that I watched uh, Quantico. It was the season finale of Quantico. So we're just going to take this coffee. No, not coffee monster. The uh, munchkin from Once More with Love to mark down that. It was the season finale of Quantico. Do you guys like Quantico? I love Quantico. But it didn't uh it didn't have very many uh episodes this season, so I don't know what was up with that. <laughs> and then moving on to Saturday, I finished my monthly spread, y'all. Uh, I have been doing uh Sort of like a memory type of uh, monthly. I still mark my bills and things like that in my monthly. But uh, I wanted to do some extra things in the monthly spread. Because it was looking kind of plain. So I did finish my monthly. And for that I am taking this girl right here from GP Sticker Studio y'all. To note down that I finished my monthly spirit. 
And I also want to mark down that I went to the grocery store. This is the day that the workers came in and they were doing work on the house. So I wanted to get out of the house <laughs> while they were doing all that. So I went to the grocery store and I don't normally go to the grocery store on um, Saturdays because it's always so crowded. So I'm taking that little shopping bag sticker from uh, Tassel's Planners. And the last thing I want to mark is that the mister and I stopped and ate barbecue on the way back from picking up his truck. So let's take this patterned quarter box here. And we're just going to place that there. And to mark eating barbecue, guys, I don't have any barbecue stickers. So I'm taking this little... Uh, chicken sticker right here from uh happy day of stickers to walk down that we stopped and got barbecue <laughs> i think those are so cute moving on to sunday i want to mark down that i had a shooter binge which is if you guys don't know what shooter is it's a usa television show based off of the movie shooter and i didn't realize that i didn't realize that it had came back on so i wanted to catch up on all of those so that i could be you know on schedule for shooter and that's a half box and then i am taking this girl from fox and pip channel surfing to note down that I binged watched Shooter. And I also want to take this Instagram sticker from Kina Prince to mark down that I posted on Insta that day as well. And then that day was pretty much a lazy day. So I'm just taking this Lazy Day sticker from Little Red Prince to mark the end of Sunday. All right, guys, that is going to be the end of this plan with me. I need to find something to put right here. Uh, let me do that quickly and I'll come back and end the video. All right, y'all, I am back and I have placed the inserts back into the planner. Uh, I went ahead and placed this little bowl right here from Sweet Plans just to fill up some space. But anyhow, guys, I love how this turned out. I think it's so cute and so much fun. And yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. And as always, I hope you are having a great day and or a great week whenever you guys are viewing this video right here. And I will talk to you guys in the next one. Bye, y'all.